question is no longer about whether there's ISIS presence in Afghanistan, but it is more of how strong is their presence in the northeastern provinces. Uh, thank you very much for the question. Uh, I believe that uh, uh, the peace talks that are going in Afghanistan, uh, these are definitely uh, uh, affecting uh, the other fighters or the other fighting groups that are existing in Afghanistan. There is a very uh, little presence of the ISIS at the moment, but if we do not take care of this ISIS uh, problem uh, regionally, I believe that it will be increased and they will expand their footprints in Afghanistan mm -hmm. and then it will become a threat for not only Afghanistan but also for the neighboring countries, for the region and also for the world. Uh, at the moment, we believe and we have, we have always claimed that the war that is currently going on in Afghanistan is not the war of the Afghans themselves. It is the war of the region, it is the war of the world that is fought in Afghanistan and that only Afghans are sacrificed and they are the victims of this war. Right, so but you mentioned something here that war, there is a presence of ISIS there and it's not just a threat to Afghanistan, it could be a threat to Central Asian states. But isn't this a confirmed fact that the presence of ISIS right now in Afghanistan, having been defeated from Syria and Iraq, have repositioned and re-strengthened their positions there in Afghanistan? So they already exist as a risk to Central Asian states. There is, there is the, uh, some signs of uh, ISIS in Afghanistan these days, and they have some very low number uh, of attacks uh, in different cities, especially in Kabul and in Jalalabad. Well, there are various so, intelligence reports that confirm just alone from 2015 to 2017, there were over 60 attacks. In fact, in 2017 alone, all the civilian deaths, 22% were attributed to ISIS. So that doesn't sound like exactly, a very low number. Exactly, exactly. Then they were fought by uh, they were fought back by the Afghan military and security forces, and they were tackled. Uh, they were all almost eliminated. But once again, uh, I guess some groups uh, uh, which we do not know clearly which groups or which countries are supporting ISIS in Afghanistan, and they want to expand the activities of ISIS when the Taliban. Uh, will be finished or when they, when they will agree on a peace in Afghanistan with the Afghan government, then I guess this will be a replacement uh, for the Taliban. But it we almost, as Afghans it almost seems okay. Get